Hello. For I proceeded forth and came from God. Neither came I of myself, but he sent me. Yes, he did. Now I said, here you go. Why? Why do you not understand my speech? Why? Why don't you understand what I'm trying to do for you? Why? Amen. Why do you not understand my speech? It's because you cannot hear my words. Why can't you hear me? Why don't you understand? Why? 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 Hello. Mm, that one got me. You want me to tell you why you can't hear me? You want to know why? This is why. Verse 44. You are of your father the devil. Amen. Oh, look how that You are of your father the devil and the lust of your father that you will do. Uh -huh. He was a murderer yes, from the Lord. beginning and abode not in the truth yes. because there is no truth in him. Oh, well. When he speaketh a lie, he speaketh of his own for he is a liar and the father yes. of it. Yes. That's why you can't hear him. That's right. yes. But you hear your father. Yes. Who wants the devil to be their father? Oh. Y'all want to stop letting the devil be your father? You hear his voice quicker than you hear Jesus. Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Keep going. Verse 45. And because I tell you the truth, they don't like me right now because I'm saying that. Mm -hmm. Because I tell you the truth, you believe me not. Which of you convinceth me of sin? And if I say the truth, why do you not believe me? He that is of God hears God's word. Yes. Amen. You therefore hear them not because you are not of God. Go ahead. Amen. Ooh, Jesus wasn't, Jesus wasn't playing. No, no. He wasn't playing. No. But we're going to switch fathers today, aren't we? Amen. Amen. Well, I love it when y'all kind of look around this room and everybody's looking right at me. That means you're listening. Amen. 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 Woo, that one got me. Amen. Let's go to 1 John, chapter 5. Y'all want to know how to get God's attention? Remember I said if you abide in him and his words abide in you, if you live in him and his words live in you, then whatever you ask, you will get. But don't believe that, you know, ask for it, receive it, you know, name it, claim it, and you ain't doing nothing right by God to get it. Amen. My God ain't giving to it, excuse me, but my God is not contributing to your sin. Amen. That's always the devil. Yes. He loves you, but he ain't, he ain't contributing to it. I'm sorry. First John 5. Y'all get anything out of what I'm saying? I'm yes, saying. <laughs> first John 5 chapter verse 14 now watch this pay close attention and this is the confidence that we have in him that if we ask anything according to your will whose will? will? my will But today, 
Amen. Romans 10. My favorite verses, verses 9 and 10. If thou shalt confess with the mouth the Lord Jesus and shalt believe in thine heart that God has raised him from the dead, thou shalt be saved. How do you know you're saved? Because I confess with my mouth and believe with my heart. So if I ask you, brother, how do you know you're saved? Oh, I confess with my mouth and believe with my heart. There you go. I know you're saved. You know what you mean. I believe it in my heart. Why? Wow. Verse 10. For with the heart man believeth unto righteousness, and with the mouth confession is made unto salvation. Because <laughs> every time you tell somebody, yeah, man, I confess with my mouth, you confess your salvation. And I believe in my heart. Because God's the only one that knows it. Amen. Amen.